Hey guys, this is me and I went and I'm talking about E3. But first, I just want to remind everyone, please pray for the people affected by the CV virus because now Los Angeles has declared a state of emergency. We knew that there were cases in California and now it seems like this is actually getting very serious. So just continue to pray for the people affected that there'll be a cure found soon and that the virus will be contained and the outbreak will end. Now, though, for those of you who know, LA is usually the spot where E3 happens, and E3 apparently is monitoring to see if it can still even happen at LA. Now, I think Small was saying maybe they'll move E3. I don't know why, but I feel like I remember E3 in Miami once. I, I just feel like it was in Miami one year, but I'm not sure. And that's a possibility, but the problem is they're only three months away about from E3. So to move it now would maybe cause, not the big boys, but maybe the indie devs and whatnot and, and some other people to not be able to go because they've already paid for their travel expenses or something like that. So I don't think if they can actually move E3 really and canceling it would just be disaster in my opinion. So I'm not exactly sure what they will do. We, we don't know what how, how the CV will be in three months. Maybe it'll be gone, especially from California area. Maybe they would have contained. But we just don't know exactly what's going to happen. And it does seem uneasy for E3 because GDC already canceled, which just, like I said in my GDC video, shows how serious this is. Obviously, we don't want to risk people's lives. So based on what we know now, if you got to cancel, you got to cancel. If you got to move, you got to move. Best case scenario, I believe, is CV will be completely gone by the time E3 comes around and they'll be able to have it in LA. Middle case scenario, they have to move it and some developers who maybe can't afford to actually go where the move is may have to just not show up at E3. And I'm not even going to mention the worst case scenario. I'm pretty sure you all know what that is. But what do you guys think will happen to E3 this year? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. May God bless you all.